All right, back out here. My favorite spot, Big Bertha and the crows. Got the kids out here horsing around. But decided to bring out a couple of uh, rigs that I haven't run before. Um, my Creighton uh, 4S. The little bitty granite everybody keeps talking about. Hasn't been my favorite truck, but I figured I'd run it, show you guys uh, how it'll handle this desert atmosphere since Christmas is uh, coming. My daughter's uh, Max, that's all shoe gooed because she broke it up so bad. It's now all shoe gooed together. We do have a video on that showing you how she did it. And then my Creighton. Now this Creighton, which is the BAK, this is my original Creighton. This has the M2C chassis. Creighton 8S. It's got the Game Changer 4 pack on it. And here is the battery pack for that, which we're gonna stuff in here. So that I can, uh, I can get these fans going and then uh, yeah it should be bulletproof so we're gonna send it off uh, the big jump this is his four pack Get this thing all turned on. I got uh, all the fans, ESC fan, all the fans on this connector because this fan failed. This was my first BAK, as uh, we like to call it. It's the first one I got. It was uh, the demo model. But I wasn't too impressed with it. It does have a Coke can motor now. It does have a Coke can motor. And uh, so we're gonna see how that does. I'm hoping I got the GoPro face the right way. So let's get it powered up. My daughter is uh, gonna run the Creighton right off the bat. This does have a Servox servo in it. The big one fifth scale servo. And uh, whoever breaks is going to grab the granite, and then we'll run that. So let's, uh, let's get to ripping out here. See how well an M2C chassis Creighton does. We're going to hit some smaller jumps uh, before we uh, go off the sending ramp and break it. I do have the orange X-Max in the back seat, just in case one of us break something or I break that I have something to run out here X max is always my backup now 
Now this thing is fast because it does have a Coke can in it, but it'll eat batteries. I'm gonna have a pile of RCs to, uh, we're gonna have a pile of RCs to clean. The Creighton is so stable. Ooh. Ooh. Well, I thought it was stable. That didn't sound good. Hitting the wing on this concrete. M2C chassis though. A lot of torque in this motor, so when you hit the trigger, it really pulls up the front end. I was used to uh, the cars from yesterday. Kind of a harsh landing, I guess. Do notice my steering. better now it's going straight I do like the remote cuz this is the new rugged it's got the little thumb trigger We'll see how that Creighton 4S does. We do have it on 4S. And that's why I grabbed that one. And uh, that's why I think that's why I don't really like the granite. Because I like 4S rigs. So those two have the 4S rigs. I think the pillow balls might be loose on this one too. I see that front wheel leaning in. Oh yeah. I guess, let me stop the camera and fix that wheel. Battery in my remote. These things uh, suck up batteries. See, now I'm drifting the other way. That's why my steering was so far off. Like I said, I haven't run this in a while. All right, restarted the video. My daughter's at the top of the hill with her uh, freshly uh, shoe gooed body. She's back to the max. She didn't like the X Max. The other one's running the Creighton. Just like me. I'm running the A 8S. She's running the 4S. How is it? It's fast. Yeah. Oh, I heard her crash. She jammed on the brakes. Her and those brakes, I don't, I don't know what to say. She loves jamming those brakes lately. Creighton sure does fly nice. That one sh should jump really good. Not You're not gonna break it.
Now this motor I've already had to warranty. Oh, something's already broken. One jump. And it looks like it broke a shock. Yep. Heavy Creighton. So it broke a shock rod end, bottomed so out hard that it split the bottom and the spring got jammed in there. So I got to find the retainer. But it'd be nice to find the piece. Here it is. Right here. And this is why I bring an X-Max. So even though we made the chassis stiff, all that kind of stuff, it's just so heavy that the shocks can't take it. It literally split this in half. That means it wedged down into it. It bottomed out so hard, which the shock is probably okay. So I've never opened these shocks or modified them or anything. But we'll uh, we'll drive it back because I'm not carrying it. What's that? She broke it. What'd you break? Jamming on the brakes. What'd you break? Well, let's. Where is it? Oh, the upper control arm, or no, the hub, the rear hub. I don't think, we don't have any hubs. I think it's green too, so. It's not, it's black. It's black. Oh. But isn't that green thing broken too? No. No, it's, fine. it's just the rear hub. So I'll grab the granite, I'll grab the X-Max. So, so we'll grab my uh, X-Max. I keep making a mistake and grabbing the orange Max, but this says X Max. Now we're back to the X Max. And this is why I make so many X Max videos. Hopefully these batteries are charged. I charged them for yesterday's bash, but I didn't need it. I didn't run this one at all. We already know, I don't have the paddles on this one today. I have the factory wheels and tires. So we'll see how the orange one does with uh, factory wheels and tires. All right, back with the X-Max. Daughter broke her car, finally broke the Max, broke a right rear hub. She's gonna take out the granite. That was the backup car I got today. Is this your remote? Yeah. Put it away. What's wrong? I can't put it in the clothes. Why? It's too hard. What do you mean too hard? I don't use clip bodies. Oh, you don't use clip bodies. You're a X Max or a Traxxas girl. You're a Traxxas fan girl? No, I used to have clip bodies and then I switched to the little twisted thingies. Oh, you mean on the slash? Yeah. The pro line body mounts? I don't like these uh, these 3S ones. They're you really have to drill these things out because you got to be exact. But they will wear in over time. So got the granite. Now, mind you, 
I've never bashed this granite at all. There's not one scratch on this body. And uh, put it in the trunk. Okay. And the same thing with the Creighton Forest that she's uh, bashing up there. I've never ran that. And I've, I've run that, both of them at a park, when I first bought them and never ran them again. So, my $2,000 Creighton broke, and I'm back to a, a stock X-Max. After work today, I've been getting off a little early every day, so we've been out bashing every day. Friday, I have an all-nighter, so. I'm really trying to get some play time in with the kids. What? What? Uh huh. How far away was it? Not that far. Well, I don't know. It was only like, I was only right here and it was right there. Well, I don't know. The fan's on. It looks like it's working. Well, it's working now, so play with it while it works. Definitely a lot faster without the paddles on. The paddles do slow it down, but you get excellent acceleration. There's a toilet in here. That is a toilet. Somebody buried the pooper scooper. And I, there's no carpet to put over it. They're both bent over looking at the RCs now. We find out what's going on. What happened? Yeah, it probably had rocks stuck in it or something. Yeah. It's brand new. But when it gets uh, rocks stuck in it, they're all in. You yeah, you need to be need to warm up. Oh, she jumped that little granite already, sent it over that wall. Little one's an animal with those little 110 scales. That's why I bought her a Max, because she'll destroy any other car. She'll literally tear them up because she thinks everything's as strong as her max. See, look at the little thing go. Running straight at herself. It's quick. I don't know why uh, Chloe loves to mess with that, my older child. She loves to get in her way and it's probably hot. I don't know. See if the fan's working. Or did you turn down, did you hit the controller? Cause it has. 
It has 100%, 50%, that kind of stuff. I didn't mess with anything. It was like that. Is that 100%? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe the battery's dead again. Go put another 3S battery in it. There's some in the trunk. I don't know what a 3S battery looks like. It looks like the one that's in there. Just match up with the numbers that are in there. It stopped. Yes, because it's probably dead. <laughs> Both of them are having issues with a brand new Creighton and a brand new Granite. A literally brand new, and they're having issues, both of them. That one won't turn. That one keeps shutting off and I'm sure it's overheating. I haven't done gears, fan, anything to that. And I remember the that line, you had to put fans on them or they would overheat. Turn it off for a minute. I bet you it just, go open it up, see if you could touch the motor. How did we find that? Yes, because it's overheating. Make sure the battery's plugged all the way in. Huh? Only turning one way. Yeah. Yeah, there's a rock stuck in there. Right oh. through this hole you get you get rocks in there. Look. There's still there, you got a bunch of them wedged in there. You gotta turn this off. I can't, am I doing something right now? You gotta wait. I can only fix one at a time. See? And the bad thing about these things, see these cutouts? Yeah. When you're sliding, these little rocks get in there and then they jam in the steering. So that's all that is, you're just getting rocks in there. I don't know how they expect you to play with one of these things in the dirt if, it, if they have those big holes right there. There's so many rocks everywhere. Now she's all mad because I'm fixing yours. So just keep an eye out for those rocks. That's it. Okay. I don't know. I'll have to put something in the corner or something. I don't know. That's a silly design. Parents, I'll tell you what. Don't buy the granite and don't buy the, uh, the Creighton 4S. 100%. Or Christmas Day, if you're out in the dirt, you'll be fixing that thing, and you'll be fixing that thing, just like I am right now. That's why I like the Big Rock. The new Big Rock, no issues. Even the old Big Rock. Even the Outcast. 4S Outcast is okay. But that Creighton 4S, Nope. That granite? Nope. What? Why are you trying to unplug it? You're not changing the battery. I'm not going to play with that anymore. I'm having too much issues. Well, is this fan working? Yeah, it was. Okay, because we put a fan on this because they overheat. See, look, it's working. Yep. Yeah, it probably had rocks in it. It didn't have any rocks. Well, either that or you land it really hard and it jolted something, but keep running it until it dies. And look, you see this? This needs to be tacked. This is how we keep ruining the balance ports by leaving these wires loose. You gotta put those wires away. I got three batteries right now that you've been running that these are broken on. So please keep those tucked away. I remember those rocks being jammed in there when I was at the park. Oh, I got this camera face way down. Sorry, guys. Start jumping it. What do you mean, no? You've been jumping it. Full trigger, send it off there, see what happens. Doesn't matter, it's not gonna break. I do know that, it's not heavy enough.
And if it breaks, we'll send it back to Arma. Tell them they can have it. Go! Told me what? Uh huh. I don't know. I think this jump has taken out more RCs than the send it jump. Because I've broken a lot on this jump. care what oh Scared of what? That ain't, you can go full trigger, that ain't going nowhere, see? You're off in the brush somewhere. I can't see. It's not that you can't see, you can't control it. I can, just a quick turn and look, you're, you're, look where you're going. Look. Look at what? I don't like this car. Well, I don't know what to tell you. That's why I don't like that mask. Well, you broke it. Uh huh. It deserves to break. No issues with the next max. I could jump this one over and over and over again. Creighton? Nope. Let's do it from this way again. I'm trying to practice. I almost ran into myself again. See? That's why I have to stand on the other side. For some reason, look at her. Let's put it down right in front of Dad. Oh. Making sure nothing's wrong. Felt a little funny. I'm better going this direction. Yeah, see, I'm accelerating. I gotta go check it. I'm accelerating and it keeps wanting to go uh, right. Make sure all the wheels are connected. Yeah, they're all. Oh, the body's popped out right here. Well, I don't think my crack's getting bigger. My light bars are staying on. Poor or brand new orange shocks are taking a beating. No. 
looks good. I don't have any loose wheels. Bearings in the back still in there? That one is. That one is. Bearings are still in there. There we go. <laughs> Man, I keep trying to run into myself. Sounds like I got sand in some gears or diffs or something. those bumps there my landings keep uh, landing to them I knew I was going to land on the wheelie bar. I was like, should I tap the brakes? Nah. I should take off the wheelie bar. I'm doing these big jumps out here. She hates that granite. And I don't blame her because I don't like it either. But I figured I'd run it. A lot of people talk very highly of the granite. Now, I don't have the new version granite. I know the, you know, but my neighbor had a granite and I saw the issues he was having. I'd much rather have a big rock. Oh, low voltage cut. Yep. There we go, guys. That's all she wrote. No more trigger. Batteries are dumped. Now, I do have more batteries. I can put more in, but... Oh. That's how you know batteries are done. And I definitely love... I know a lot of people don't like this body clip set up. See where my body's cracking there? Cracking there and cracking there. Here's my light hook up. Of course, can't hook it to this. Waiting for my stock ESC to come back for this one. By the time it comes back, I'm gonna have to rebuild this whole RC again. But I don't mind. I buy them to use them. And the Max 6 is always set up to save your battery pack so you're not killing them flat dead. I'd let you use the Max or the X Max, but you don't like it. What are you doing to that one? I can't put on the body clips. I've been stuck on the body clip for like a couple minutes now. Why? God, that's on the wrong way. literally smashed this body post you can't stand them up and push them through like you've been doing you've been trying to stand them up and push them through that way 
They just gotta go in straight. Well, how do I know? I don't. What do you mean? How do you know? I don't use flip buddies. Oh, cause your tracks is fangirl. All right, guys, I'm going to get this uh, powered off. And uh, I think we're going to call this bash session over. The whole purpose of this trip was to run my Creighton. Show you guys how my Creighton, uh, my bulletproof Creighton that broke uh, on the second or third jump. Make sure all the remotes are off. But there we go, guys. Like, comment, subscribe. The Creighton Forest is still going. It's a bulletproof RC, except uh, that whole design flaw with the steering and rocks getting in there. But I'm sure something can be done about it. But there we go, guys. Like, comment, subscribe. We will see you guys on my next video. Thanks for watching.